Hello? Yes, right away. Excuse me. Excuse me, so sorry. Sir? Yes? Sir, you have an emergency call on your private line. Uh, <laughs> yes, this, this is Burgess. Hello, Lamar. I just wanted to congratulate you. You did it. You created a world without murder. Sir, everyone wants your name on a hat. Can you sign these for us? Uh, and all you had sir. to do is kill someone to do it. Abram, hey, Jad. Jad, it's Laura. John needs a favor. I don't know what you're talking about. Okay. I'm talking about Agatha's mother, Anne Lively. Just a junkie who had a kid once and had to give her up, but surprise. She cleaned herself up, and she wanted her daughter back. She wanted Agatha. Chad, you getting this? It's a single stream from the female only with no time or incident data. Whatever this is, it isn't the future. It already happened. And the problem was, without Agatha, there was no pre-crime. She's always been the strongest of the three. You knew without Agatha, you had nothing. Without her, you wouldn't be where you are now, standing there signing autographs. Mark, you signed the Chad, what are you doing? Chad, Chad, what are you doing with that? You're up too, big man. Chad, Chad, let's think before you send that. So now you had to get rid of Anne Lively. You had to shut her up, which presented a problem. How can you kill her without the precogs seeing it? Simple. Use a system you control against her. So you hired someone to kill her for you, knowing full well the precogs would see that murder. You lured Anne Lively out to the lake with the promise of reuniting her with her daughter. in the same way the precogs predicted your John Doe would kill her. You made the real murder look like an echo, knowing the tech would do what he was trained to do, disregard it. Anne Lively became just another missing person. So, what are you gonna do, Lamar? What are you gonna do? She will save him. That little girl could have saved Sean. Don't you ever say his name! You used the memory of my dead son to set me up. You used the memory of my dead son to set me up! That was the one thing you knew that would drive me to murder. What are you gonna do now, Lamar? What are you gonna do now, Lamar? How are you gonna shut me up? It's over. The 
question you have to ask is, what are you gonna do now? No doubt the precogs have already seen this. No doubt. You see the dilemma, don't you? If you don't kill me, precogs were wrong and pre-crime is over. If you do kill me, you go away. But it proves the system works. Precogs were right. So what are you going to do now? What's it worth? Just one more murder. You're right in hell with a halo, but people will still believe in pre-crime. All you have to do is kill me, like they said you would. Except, you know your own future, which means you can change it if you want to. You still have a choice, Lamar, like I did. Yes, I have a choice. And I made it. Forgive me, John. Forgive me. Forgive me, my boy.